Okay, guys. And uh, and to do my, I did my promo. I hope you guys will like it. Look at it and like go. Oh my god. I mean, I know my pro I know by no one's standards, my promos are anything special. But hey, I wanted to make my freaking channel more more professional. You know what I mean? Oh, in my own way. So. You know, I want you guys to take a look at that. I'm also going to put some of these promos on Vidly just because. But not what I'm here to talk about right now, kitties. What I'm here to talk about. <laughs> what I'm here to talk about is we're getting a new Hyperdimension Neptunia anime. No word on the, no word on the super, uh, super Neptunia RPG. Or Brave Neptune. I'm calling it Super Neptune the RPG. Not because I have some sort of plan or anything. Because that's totally not what I'm going to do. But, yeah. So, we're going to take a quick, quick little look at it. Because there's like a little teaser. And I'm, uh, we're gonna do a tiny little bit of a reaction out of it because, you know, you quit your day job. It's become very tiny. Streamer. Want to become a pro streamer? Get your panels, overlays, banners. And I saw it when I was half asleep, so we're about to look at it when I'm fully awake. <laughs> okay, here we go. Is that Neptune in molten lava with her thumb pointing up like this is Terminator? God damn it, Nep. This is going to be so cool. I don't know, even looking. Basically, adult Neptune is in here. Now, you guys... Okay, listen. 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 If all you guys are like, Bugs, isn't this a Chris Chan thing? No. Hyperdimension is an every... It's an everybody thing. I mean, yeah, Chris kind of... Ugh, pollutes it. But, but... But let me tell you something. Let me tell you something right now. I love these characters, and I love this, and I love the world that they are in, to the point where I'm making my own show about it, and yeah, it's awesome, and really, if Chris Chan scared you off of this, you deserve, like, please, let me be the logical fan and just tell you, it's a fun time, if you want to just chill, if you want to just play a few RPGs that are a little bit hard, and also... And also, if you like the characters, look at some of the translated drum CDs, because there's a lot of drum CDs that are translated. And, you know, and, you know, these characters, maybe just archetypes, but they have, you know, they are a lot deeper than you know. I mean, I ain't talking like, I ain't talking like Shakespearean levels of deep, but, you know, you might actually like these characters, and you might gel with them. More so than you think. Everybody's here. But guys, but guys, I want to ask you a question. I want to ask you a question. If adult Neptune is here, like we're seeing all, like all of her little like static poses, right? We're seeing all this. But the one thing I want to know is, okay, the one thing I want to know is, like, are we, go, are we, like, it's called, like, the anime is called Neptune's Summer Vacation, but does that mean we're going to see Uzume? Are we going to have, are we going to have an arc with Uzume? Because they, I mean, 
They had to figure out a way to implement Uzume and Adult Neptune. You could implement Adult Neptune because she just travels through dimensions. Like a, like a bunch of characters I created do. But, you know, if you're going to do Adult Neptune, just do Adult Neptune. And if we're going to have another season after this, I doubt we will. Because it took us this long to get this season. But if we do, <coughs> they're going to have to adapt. They're going to have to adapt the Mega Dimension storyline. But I think that should be for another season. Or maybe this is going to work up to that. Because I would really like that. I would really like to see I would really like to see Uzume and their and the anime's take on the Mega on the Mega Dimension, you know, the ne Hyper Dimension Neptunia Mega Dimension thing, you know, with Uzume's story and everything else. So, you know, I think it'd be pretty cool, but I know, but I know in my heart that this is going to be a little bit more laid back, with a bit of seriousness here and there. So I'm, you know, I'm all for this. I'm all for this. Let's, as a fan, as a fan of Hyperdimension Neptunia, I'm all for this. I'm down. <laughs> And I think this is Neptune's next form. And I think this is Neptune's next next form in the anime. In the anime. Or this is like some different variant of her next form. This is going to be awesome. But from what but from what I'm saying, they might actually implement Mega Mention a little bit in here. I don't know. But I am happy right now. You guys don't understand how I feel. I've been waiting for a season two for the actual anime for a while. And I was always spitballing ideas of how they could go, what they could do. Because if you really want, because if they really want to not implement any of the stuff from the main games, there's a lot of spinoff titles. But, you know... I don't know. This is interesting. This is awesome. I wanted to just say that. I wanted to make a little video. And see you guys in the, see you guys later. And uh, yeah. See you guys later. And, and cue my outro.